A doctor charged in the fatal overdose of actor Matthew Perry today is pleading guilty in court. The physician now facing years behind bars for helping to obtain the drug ketamine. Eyewitness News reporter Sophie Flay is live in downtown LA where the criminal case is far from over. Sophie. Dr. Mark Chavez is appearing in court today pleading guilty to drug charges. He now faces a maximum sentence of 10 years in federal prison. Dr. Mark Chavez seen leaving federal court in downtown after pleading guilty to drug charges connected to the death of Matthew Perry. Media swarming him and his attorney. He accepted responsibility. He's pled guilty. He admitted a lot of facts on the record. Admitting in his plea agreement, he obtained and distributed ketamine without a legitimate medical purpose. He admitted to transferring more than 20 vials of liquid ketamine plus ketamine lozenges to Dr. Salvador Placencia to be given to the actor. 54 year old Chavez becoming the third person to admit guilt in the aftermath of the friend star death last year. He is now facing a maximum sentence of 10 years in federal prison. Criminal law expert Lou Shapiro says it's unlikely he'll do that much time. He could be looking at maybe something close to like five, six, seven instead of 10 if his cooperation results in the convictions of the other two outstanding defendants who have not pled guilty. Chavez is free on bond after turning over his passport and surrendering his medical license. Shapiro noting this will send a message to the medical community. Anytime that somebody dies uh, of an overdose of some sort, and it is a doctor involved. The doctor is held to a higher standard than me or you. They are in a position of trust. When they abuse that trust, they are held accountable by the court. And again, this case is far from over. Chavez's sentencing is scheduled for April 2nd, 2025. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.